Tonight we can reveal major flaws in how background checks are being processed for people wanting to work with children. A new report has highlighted huge delays and holes in the system that are putting hundreds of WA kids at risk. While police run background checks, almost anyone can work with WA kids. We are talking about multiple opportunities of vulnerability for children. People expect more. A new independent report revealing the application for a working with children card is enough to get almost anyone immediate approval. 53 who were eventually refused a card last year were able to work with kids while their application was being processed. On average, it took over two days for the applicant to be denied, allowing a total 14,192 days of WA kids being at risk. We do need to uh, increase our processing for working with children's checks. A mechanism known as an interim negative notice can be used by the Department of Communities, but it's not enough. Where there might have been um, some sort of violent assault or um, an inter interjurisdictional um, conviction that can take a lot of time. The Auditor General found the department was focusing too heavily on the worker, trying to reduce the risk of issuing an interim negative notice incorrectly, rather than looking to reduce the risk to children. As a regulatory body, the Department of Communities Monitoring and Enforcement was poor, not knowing how many of its own staff needed a working with children check. We have a department that doesn't even know what's happening within its own department. The department is vowing to implement all recommendations by June as the minister pushes for a national database. Jacqueline Robson, Nine News.